Lucas Media, we got some news coming out of boxing. There's this rumor going around that Tank Davis versus Frank Martin pay-per-view numbers are in. Now, some people are speculating, at least right now, the numbers are around 200,000, which sometimes would be pretty decent, right? However, the issue is people have been going at Devin Haney because they said that him and Ryan Garcia wasn't selling and Devin Haney and Rikers Progress wasn't selling, and that Tank is a pay-per-view star. Everybody wants to support Tank. Everybody watches Tank. This is what Tank's handlers are saying. And here's the thing, right? People was watching the fight. There was a lot of people that told me that they were watching a fight. I know they had several fight parties down here where I was at. So I would assume that the numbers would reflect Tank would do at least 500,000 buys, buys, you know, somewhere around there, right? Well, 200,000, honestly, is not good for tank davis standards now let me tell you why if this number is true right but first we got to think about it is the fire stick piracy most people aren't going to pay 84.99 for a fight anymore and most people didn't know it was not like it's a stack card from beginning to end that the casual fans know if it was something like how the people over in saudi arabia is doing I can see something like that. But what's going on with us, where a lot of times you don't know who Joe Schmo is, people aren't going to pay for that. So you got that going on. And then because Tank Davis doesn't have a dancing partner, meaning he's not fighting a Devin Haney. He's not fighting a Lomachenko. He wasn't fighting a Shakur Stevenson. These are names that people will still be willing to pay out of their pocket for now back in the day i'm sure this would have did numbers floyd was able to get away with it with a couple of people that he fought however in today's time you just can't get rid of it you know it's too the piracy is, is too strong out here that's just like tyson fury and Alexander Usyk. there's reports coming out that at least 20 million people watch the fight you know through some type of streaming site fire stick something and that's just the way the game is but y'all seeing that Tank Davis and Ryan Garcia did around, they're saying at least 1.2 million. But that's because people knew who Ryan Garcia was. People knew who Tank Davis was. And even though most experts still had Tank Davis to win, Ryan Garcia had such a huge, huge fan base that a lot of time, a lot of people thought that he would still be able to have a solid chance. But, you know, if you it, moving forward, Tank will have to fight a better competition. Like I said, he says he has this list. I'm going to hold him to the list. I really hope that his fans don't try to turn and say, oh, well, I mean, take a fight who you want to fight. No, no, you called out. You said... It can be Loma, it can be Shakur Stevenson, and it can be Devin Haney. So we want to see the best fight the best. But yeah, if these numbers are true, I mean, hey, this is what happens in today's era of boxing. If you want to have bigger numbers, you're going to have to fight the best. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.